the Sunday Bible services from the St. Philip Baptist Church in Northwest Louisiana. The Reverend Julian, the pastor. We'll start this morning by reading our scripture taken from Habakkuk. We're going to start reading at the second chapter, beginning at the very first verse. We have it, it reads as thus. It says, I will stand upon my watch and set me upon the tower and will watch to see what he will say unto me. What shall I answer when I am approved or reproved? And the Lord answered me and said, Write the vision, make it plain upon the tables, that he may run that readeth it. For the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it shall speak and not lie. Though it tarry, wait for it, because it will surely come it will not tarry and for it says behold his soul which is lifted up is not upright in him but the just shall live by faith and then the Bible in Isaiah says wait upon the Lord they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength they shall mount upon wings as eagles. They shall run and not get weary. They shall walk and not faint. Let us bow our heads for a word of prayer. Our heavenly Father, it is again that we have come. We come, dear God, no stranger, but we come with bowed heads and we come with humble hearts. But above all, we come in the name of Jesus. We come thanking you for another week. We thank you for another day, dear God, that thou has blessed and kept us in your care. We know that you, God, we have all power in your hand. Your keeper. And you've kept us for these many years. And we thank you, Lord. Now, dear God, we ask you to look down upon our services here today. We have the sick among us. We have those, dear God, with bowed heads and sorrow. We have those full of pain. We have those, dear God, that you have blessed to come from all walks of life to come to St. Philip this morning. So we thank you for it. Then, dear God, we ask our blessings upon these services here today. The people, we ask you to keep them in your care, abounding in your word. We know that you, God, and you have power. You can do all things but fail. Now, dear God, keep us once again. We'll always be mindful to give you praises, glory, and all of the honor. These blessings and others. We ask in thy son Jesus' name and we pray. Amen. 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 Thank you.
going to see victory. Mm -hmm. And struggling over the last year, five, six months, we're going to see a victory. Mm -hmm. Because the battle don't belong to us. It belongs to the Lord. And I learned everything the, evil, everything the devil meant for evil, God always turned it around. Matter of fact, I can use the turn around. Is there anybody who can use the turn around? Brooks, I heard you this morning. Worship is our weapon. We ain't come to worship God this morning. See, we have to learn to smile in our struggle. Yeah. Can you praise him in the midst of a pandemic? Can you praise him in the midst of your storm? Can you praise him in the midst of your Can you praise him in the midst of your sickness? Can you praise him in the midst of the broken heart? Worship is my weapon. How many can shout before the battle is it was on? How many can shout knowing you got the victory in your veins? Worship is my weapon. Brothers and sisters, there's a remembrance that comes to mind for the turnaround. Knowing that God is with you. Realizing you're never alone. See, you got to talk to yourself sometimes. That you're something, I'm not alone. God is with me. He knows my heart. Knows my thoughts. Tasha God said, knows my name. Yeah. Oh, how he walks with me. Yeah. Oh, how he talks with me. Tells me I'm his own. Anybody know that God is with me? It's a remembrance. Not only knows my name, uh -huh. he knows my interests. Yeah. We stop by here today, Lord. I need you. Does anybody want to turn around? Yeah. Thought I wasn't going to make it many times. The, the, uh, the steps was against me. Yeah. Not in my favor. But I survived it. Yeah. Is there any survivors this morning? Yeah. Yeah. Has anybody been through some stuff this morning? Yeah. I'm a survivor. Yeah. Holy Savior, I'm going to trust him. Yeah. But I'm a survivor. Yeah. Uh, rejoicing. Why we rejoice? Because the 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 the, the, the omnipotent ability of our God. You see, brother, nothing is too hard for my Lord. Nothing is impossible for my God. See, Isaiah was giving us a redemptive plan and a purpose for our life. Yes. We can live knowing we are loved and forgiven. Even, even if time doesn't heal our wounds, I know I'm safe. I know I'm healed. I know I'm loved. I know that I'm free. But I know that God is good. I hear you, Brother Lawrence, we serve a good, good Father. Does anybody know He's good this morning? It's a rejoicing. Because we, we know that God can do anything but fail. Then there's a releasing. We have to learn how to release our faith. Yes. Amen. We have to learn how to release our faith, help the Holy Ghost, for a move of God. Yes. Yes. Brothers and sisters, we got to live in, 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 in anticipating a miracle. Yes. We got to wake up expecting a miracle. Yes. We got to wake up expecting God yes. to move on your behalf. I expect God to turn my doubt into shout. Yeah. I expect God to turn my trials into triumph. I expect God to turn my troubles into victory. Because the word promises that he give us beauty for actions. His word promises that we just hold on. But before we say that day that week, things going to turn around. How many believe that things would get better? Yes. Point number one, we have to talk to God about our trials. Yes. 
and moaning in song. Mm. Anxiety, stress, discourage, despair, and grief. Mm. Has cried sometimes, mm. been sad mm. before and after during the pandemic. Mm. Ashes represents God's punishment due to sin or disobedience. Well, but the beauty we invited, we ain't preaching condemnation, but the beauty of God through prayer. Prayer changes things. Prayer changes people. And prayer still works. Through prayer there's restoration, healing, and forgiveness. But Rev, what God can do in the middle of my mess? See, God is not the author of sin and disease. He's the healer of all disease. I want to know if anybody that heard of Jehovah Rapha, Christ the healer. Anybody know that blood was shed for him? Does anybody know Christ the healer? We have to learn to talk to Jesus about our ashes. See, Jesus kind of react the work of the devil. Y'all ain't heard that. Jesus constantly reacted to the work of the devil. He defeated Satan with the word of God. Beloved, I wish above all things, help the Holy Ghost, that thou mayest prosper, be in good health, even as thy soul prosper. May in all these things we are more than conquerors. All things work together for the good of them that love the Lord. Many are the affliction of the righteous, but the Lord delivered them out of the Lord.
on what we lost, but on who we have. Yeah. We have Jesus, yeah. awesome Savior, yeah. healer, yeah. provider, yeah. comforter, yeah. remedy, yeah. all in all, free yeah. of the trouble, yeah. right in the morning star, yeah. living up the day, yeah. rock in the room, yeah. shelter in the room. Yeah. My friend Jesus, stick closer yeah. than the brother. Yeah. We have to learn to be happy with Jesus. Yeah. Lost some stuff. Uh -huh. Cried some nights. Yes, sir. Been down and up. Yes, sir. Friends turn it back on. Yes. As long as I got uh -huh. King Jesus. Yes. How many happy with Jesus? Yes. How many happy with the Lord this morning? Yes. We have to learn mm -hmm. how to shift our own atmosphere. Yeah. Have your own. Praise Paul. Yeah. Brothers and sisters, before you turn around, you have to make your Thanksgiving present tense. Because in God's presence, mm -hmm. there's power. Amen. Say that's the fullness of joy in his presence. There are plenty of opportunities to tell God thank you. Yeah. See, when you've been through a lot, you got a lot to be thankful for. Amen. 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 Finally, we have to become examples of beautiful action. We have to learn how to respect our praying women. There are many praying women in the Bible. Paul is getting next to me. You get your socks. Don't get mad with me. <laughs> There's something about praying sisters. Eve exchange for sinful ashes mm -hmm. for beauty. Hannah exchange her sorrow for ashes for beauty. Rahab exchange her immoral ashes for beauty. Mary Magdalene exchange her shameful ashes for beauty. Ruth exchange her lonely ashes. For beauty. The prodigal son mama exchanged her tearful ashes for beauty. Mary, Jesus' mother, exchanged the painful suffering of our son to all sufficient Savior. How are the women, huh? Look at the church right now. It's two to one women. We need to give God some praise for praying women.
have to allow God to turn your confusion yeah. into peace. Yeah. You have to allow God to turn your worry yeah. into worship. Yeah. You have to allow God to turn your pain yeah. into praise. Yeah. You have to allow God to turn your mourning yeah. into dance. Yeah. You have to allow God to turn your sorrow yeah. into joy. Yeah. You have to allow God to give you beauty. Yeah.
Bless my sisters and brothers. 